This is how a mass murderer is taken to court, at speed and under heavily armed guard. Anders Breivik arrived calm and composed, even smiling a little. As with his first appearance, he greeted the court with a fascist salute. He has acknowledged killing 77 people last July, and today he spent several moments looking at some of the survivors and their families in the public gallery. But if he was moved by their presence, he didn't show it. Later, off camera, he read a prepared statement claiming to have carried out the most sophisticated and spectacular political attack in Europe since World War II. He said he'd acted out of goodness, not evil, to prevent a wider civil war over multiculturalism. And he insisted that he would have done it again. This case has caused horror and outrage in Norway, even it seems for one of the judges. Thomas Indebure, a lay judge, admitted writing before he'd been appointed to the case that Breivik deserved the death penalty. He was replaced before Breivik took the stand. Mr. Indebure did not state that he had given such expressions will weaken the uh, faith in his impartiality. Conclusion, Mr. Inderbur shall be dismissed as a lay judge. Breivik denies murder and claims he acted in self-defence. He's due to give evidence for several more days, but not on camera. The courts refused to provide a televised platform for his extremist views. Richard Lister, BBC News.